everyone has secondary containment areas, especially in tank farms, they're there. Uh, they can be inside a building or outside the building. But the problem is secondary containment areas is you have a, a variety of acids that can be present in the tanks. Some of the bigger problems is sulfuric acid, hydrofluoric acid, the more aggressive type acids. So we have a solution for those uh, type of acids in our containment areas. Now this is a replica of a containment area, a little small since I can hold up my hand, but normally these things are you know, pretty good size. Now one thing you have to have in a containment area, you have to have a composite that will withstand the contents of that material for 72 hours. But once you use a conventional material uh, and you get a leak, or you get a, a big leak, that kind of destroys the, the solvent-based coatings that's out there. So they're good for 72 hours and that's it. Now Belzona containment area materials will give you one year immersed. It's not just for the required period of time is 72 hours, but for a full year immersed with the Belzona materials.